Hello everyone. My name is Shakila Shanmugam and um, the purpose of my uh, video today is to introduce myself to you. Um, I'm a Malaysian Indian woman and I was raised in uh, Guthrie plantations. For those who don't know what Guthrie plantations are, they are a group of uh, estates or plantations uh, run by this company called Guthrie uh, group of companies and um, Guthrie was one of the oldest and largest companies in uh, Malaysia run by the British. Today it's no longer run by the British and it's called, uh, I think it's called Port Modala National. And um, the reason I was, I grew up in the estates was because uh, my father was uh, a planter. So the term planter means estate manager. So uh, the childhood that I had was uh, indeed lovely. We had so much of space, a huge garden surrounded by uh, rubber trees and uh, sometimes oil palm. Um, huge garden, lots of dogs to play with uh, because my father was a dog lover. And um, it was, when, when I look back at my childhood now, I would say it was, it was a fairy tale childhood. I, was so surrounded by nature that I yearn for nature now. You know, I love to have uh, something green near me and I feel I can breathe only when there's uh, plants and I'm surrounded by plants. Well, that's so far as my childhood goes. So, uh, later, after my education was uh, completed, I got married and I stayed in um, Kuala Lumpur. And uh, for most of my married life, I've been a homemaker and also a part-time English teacher. I must say that I'm truly blessed to be able to have had that uh, time and space to uh, enjoy watching my daughter grow up um, firsthand because I was at home. So I must say that you know it's truly rewarding watching uh, your child grow up. But at the same time, it's always good to have something for yourself. So teaching English was um, something that I did for myself. I enjoyed teaching the English language and I enjoyed uh, interacting with children, uh, listening to their perspective. Um, children see the world so differently from how we do. So I liked um, that aspect of teaching and uh, teaching them how to speak better and so on. So at present, uh, since our daughter has gone overseas to study, I am experiencing life as an empty nester. Uh, it's a very different life as compared to when your child is at home because your purpose is um, very different. Um, my husband and I are on our own right now except when uh, our daughter comes to visit us um, in between her terms and uh, her study, you know, her terms in her uni and so on. But um, we are kept on our toes by this little one. She, her name is Angel, she's a Snow River and she is um, 12 years old, going on 13. Uh, she keeps us on our toes. She's actually our daughter's dog. We got her when my daughter was about 14 years old and um, uh, she's, um, she's part of our family. So the purpose of my taking on this um, or starting this channel was uh, basically to start something different. To um, start something different, to take on the challenge of uh, documenting my passions. Um, there are a lot of things that I wanted to do in uh, I was younger but of course when you're young your priorities are also different correct i mean for those of you who are, are older would realize that so now i thought i would like uh, you know take on all the sessions that i've had before and i've got the time to indulge in it why not document it you know and share it with others um it's not easy documenting everything and you know uh, filming yourself it's a totally new thing it's challenging it's exciting but I truly believe that it's never too late to take on something different. Why not now? If it, if, uh, you know, if I couldn't do it before, why not now? So, well, that's how uh, the whole idea for this, uh, this uh, starting a channel came about. So this channel will be a mix of lifestyle, cooking, um, travel, uh, basically living a healthy, clean life. I really believe in that. I believe uh, in uh, traditional recipes passed down through the generations. Um, 
I especially like the fact that I am a Malaysian Indian. So uh, when it comes to cooking or traditions or even cultures, uh, we are not um, we Malaysian Indians. We're not all um, Indian in our perspective and our outlook. We um, because we are influenced by the other cultures as well, and uh, our cooking, and especially the cooking that my mum, she was from uh, an island up north, um, which is called uh, Pulau Pinang. A long, long time ago, during the when we were part of the British colony, it was called the Pearl of the Orient, so the Pinang Island. But today it's called Pulau Pinang. Pulau meaning island, and Pinang is the name of the island. Her food was infused with the um, the in her Indian food was often infused with um, Malay traditions and uh, Malay uh, recipes or, or Malay styles of cooking, and even. Um, Chinese method. So, Malaysian Indian food is, we Malaysian Indians, we love traditional Indian food because traditionally our roots are from India. But our foods, or rather we enjoy foods that are a mix as well because we have, uh, since we were young, we are exposed to the different foods of the different cultures. And sometimes they blend the different races, they blend the cultures and they blend the recipes and we have different styles of cooking. Sometimes we, we have very traditional foods as well. So it's quite, um, a, the, the paradigm is different in Malaysia and I love that about my country. So besides cooking, my channel will also be about um, gardening, composting, um, traveling, when I do travel, that is. And, um, also, I would like to uh, bring some awareness to this taboo topic in my country, um, which is mental health. I would like to draw some attention to mental health. I would like to explore this, not really explore, I would like to bring some attention to how uh, to living a life, uh, a positive life, a fruitful life, and to live a life that, uh, like everybody else, despite having some um, disabilities, some difficulties, or being different from everyone else. This will be a topic that I would talk about, but uh, very much later in, um, in my channel. So I hope you enjoy this channel um, as much as I know that I am going to. Thank you very much, everybody.